I think we all got to play the same game. You know, so, um, but it is what it is. These are the, these are the rules we're playing by. And so uh, I hope that we can make it more competitive. I'm sure they love it, but, you know, I mean, it's, it's the same storyline every year, right? And um, like I said, if you've got one group that's offering $3,000, $3,400 a year in cash to these kids that another group isn't, we're not, it's the scholarship isn't apples and apples. So are we really playing on the same level? Um, I don't know. Montana State head coach Jeff Choate there in response to a question this week at his press conference on whether or not NDSU's run has been good for FCS football. He mentions NDSU and James Madison as the only programs offering full cost of attendance at the FCS level. And so yesterday, as NDSU signs 24 on early signing day, I asked NDSU head coach Matt Enns if cost of attendance seems to be a drawing factor when he's in kids' living rooms or if it's really more of just a cherry on top. I think it's more of a cherry on top. I think most of these kids want to be bison. Uh, all these North Dakota kids grow up wanting to be bison, so I don't think cost of attendance is, has anything to do uh, with, with their decision making. Uh, I think it's the quality of people that are associated with our program, our administration, uh, and then the quality of players that we currently have here, and then the tradition that we've established here at NDSU. Coach Entz referencing the North Dakota kids growing up wanting to be Bison. He and his staff are signing five from the state with an increasing emphasis here near the Metro this year. Those local signings including the children of Bison alumni like Davies Ty Satter whose father Tony was a major playmaker back in the division two days and Shanley's Joe Cava whose older brother Jake is currently in the Bison locker room. It's a special day for these families and an emotional one. Pride, you know, you just buys and pride, I guess. You, 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 you dream their dreams and here you go. Pretty cool. I kind of always wanted to go to NDSU just since my brother's gone there and that's kind of just been my dream to go play there. I'm just really excited to be able to be a part of uh, the Bison and I know he's super proud and um, really excited for him to be able to see me play after he did. In all, NDSU signing 24. Coach N saying they got one of each position, an emphasis he says he set for the class. They do have space open, though, and could add to this class in February on National Signing Day.